Hey guys, it's Rachel. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to I am so excited because I am prepping for my mom and I's little Easter celebration. So what we do for every single holiday is we have a little sleepover night and we have like themed goodies and we have like we just watch like themed movies and it is so much fun. So I decided to take you guys along with me this time. We started this tradition um, when I moved into my apartment. It's been so much fun that I decided this time I wanted to take you guys along with me. So right now it's a couple days before and I am at TJ Maxx and I want to get like a little filler for her Easter basket. I have all of it pretty much done but I just want to get like a little necklace or something like something sentimental um, and they have some good stuff in TJ Maxx. So I'm like you know what that sounds like a good idea so that is my stop. I need to go to the grocery store and like get, actually I need to go to Target and get some like sprinkles or something like that for a little treat I'm going to make, but I think that's a tomorrow thing. Um, but yeah, you guys, I just wanted to take you guys with me and let's go in TJ Maxx and it is now raining and uh, let's see what we can find. This headband is giving me mastermind vibes and look at the little... Guys, they have adorable headbands right now. The last time I tried one on though, it really hurt my head. Um, but look at that one. That's really pretty for summer. <gasps> I'm kind of tempted. Help, Taylor's influence. This is really pretty. They have so many pretty things here. Like, even like these are gorgeous. And like these, oh my gosh, gorgeous. Guys, this teacup is gorgeous. I actually got the matching bowls. Um, about a week ago for like fruit and stuff and then look at these oh my gosh gorgeous oh my god look at this little London makeup bag that's gonna be perfect oh my god like oh my god y'all I just almost humbled myself in the TJ Maxx parking lot so I was walking one way this lady was walking the other and we were just smiling at each other um because this car was like letting us go and I lost my balance Twisted my ankle, thank God it doesn't hurt, um, and I stumbled. I almost fell on my face in the middle of the parking lot. It's fine. It's fine because you know what? At the end of the day, it didn't happen. So, um, so that could not have been more unsuccessful for finding my mom a little something, um, but I did buy that little headband. Um, I thought it would be really cute in the summer, and honestly, I need to like, I've gone through a lot of my closet and I'm just kind of like tired of wearing the same thing so and then I always see people eating these these are the tiny bites um, they're like the chocolate cones and it looks so good and let me tell you guys something you know that infamous cat shirt that like I was like oh my god I'm gonna wear this on tortured poets day um, it was long sleeve nope I have returned that um, <laughs> got my refund for that I found the perfect top I was out shopping with Bobby and let me tell you it was the perfect top and I was like I am returning that cat shirt because I was kind of iffy on it however I just ran into said cat shirt again however this one has a purple tint and purple's my favorite color and it's short sleeve so I'm gonna give it a go again because I didn't hate it and so funny enough my mom and I were in TJ Maxx um just like browsing one night after we had dinner and she was like oh my god look at this cat shirt Rachel and I'm like I just returned that and she's like, no way. And I'm like, yeah, way. Like, I literally just returned that. She's like, it's so cute. I'm so surprised you did. Well, I like this style better. And I think it's much cuter. And I think it'll be really, really cute in the summer. Um, it's kind of like a flouncy button up. Like, it's not like, you know, I don't know, structured. It's kind of like carefree. And then at the bottom, it's high-low again. And it's the same print, but the cats are bigger. And honestly... I wanted to give it a go again. If I don't like it, guess what? I'll return it. But I think it might be really cute with like even like a black little skirt. Or I think it could be really cute with like black ripped jeans. That's the vibe I'm going for. Um, I have made the executive decision to treat myself to Chick-fil-A. So that is what I'm doing. And I will see you guys when I do something else for uh, the little prep for this weekend. But I think that'll be tomorrow because this girl she's ready to go home and she's tired i can tell you that it is so nasty out and i wish i had done this yesterday however i am running around in the rain um do i need to go on target no could i make do with what i have 
yes, but like it's Target, I want to, it's fun. Um, my straight hair is about to go down because uh, it's nasty out, but I've got a clip on lock, so we're okay. Um, we're gonna go in Target. I, I did go to the grocery store and I got a couple goodies and I'm gonna make some treats. Um, and here our agenda is strawberries and sprinkles. That's our agenda in here. What we come out with, we shall see. Let's go in. Guys, look how cute the friend's keychain is. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so far, I got my mom a coloring book for her Easter basket because she loves to color, and my dad a glass um, that was $3 for his birthday. That's in July, but I'm preparing early. Can I tell you something insane? 22 days from when I'm filming this, I'll be getting tortured poets. Like just thinking about standing here so soon with tortured poets. You know, Target on album release days for Taylor is just like the best feeling. I'm so excited to be here with Emma. Like, I think I'm gonna go with this one. Yes, I'm drinking my Dunkin' coffee um, at 9.38 at night. Don't mind me. Okay, hello. I want to do a little thing called making Easter treats with Rachel. Now here we have three apples. I've never had so many apples in my fridge because it's just me. I don't buy that many apples. Like I'll buy a couple at a time because I don't want them to go bad. Don't want to waste them. Anyways, I have a ton of apples in my fridge because the other night I got fixated on this little treat, this little dessert, if you will. And I was like, immediately volunteering this is what I'm going to make for Easter so I'm doing a little trial run tonight um, and I wanted to make some for my mom and I for tomorrow night anyways but um, anyways I want to see how this turns out so I have apples I have my knife I have popsicle sticks that I ordered on Amazon they're the thick popsicle sticks and you can probably find these at Hobby Lobby or Michael's or something. However, when um, I got fixated on this, I didn't feel like running around and like looking for them. I was like, you know what? I can find them on Amazon. I'm sure to have them. Here they are. So I got the thicker popsicle sticks <laughs> um, and I'm not gonna be like Taylor and get a popsicle stick glue scar on my knee um if you know you know so now we have popsicle sticks we have a tray with parchment paper and the main attraction of the show is going to be our cookie cutters now if this doesn't work i may shut it here okay this is going to be adorable if this works um so i got a little bunny and then this is another bunny, but like the full body of the bunny. And then um, a chick and a little egg. Now, what we're gonna do with these is we're gonna cut the apple vertically, not horizontally. We're gonna be making chocolate covered bunny popsicles. You're probably thinking, what, what do you, what? Stick with me here, okay? Um, I got bigger apples. I've already washed them, don't worry. I do wash my fruit before I eat them. Um, but we're gonna cut them and then we're going to cut them into the shape with the cookie cutter. Now we're gonna do one. I just cut this nice piece of apple. We're gonna do a little trial, if you will, okay? Um, and then we're gonna dip them in chocolate. Now, got the bigger popsicle sticks so they, you know, go through there. The first one that we're going to try is a little, ooh, these might be too big. You know what? We're going to try an Easter egg first, because why not? So you're going to really need to like push this down. Um, there you go. Just use your whole hand. That works better. So don't you worry. I'll be eating the leftover apple. Um, so I'm gonna do 
<laughs> this is already a mess, but it's our first one. We're not gonna we're not gonna hate on ourselves. This one's a little thick, if you will. Um, we can and you can then take your knife um, and kind of like just make it so it looks a little more Easter eggy, if you will. Now we have our first one. Here's an Easter egg. I'm gonna put it on the parchment paper and then I'm gonna cut some more. And then I'm gonna put the popsicle sticks in. Actually, I think I'll wait to put the popsicle. No, I won't. We're talking this through. Um, this is gonna be cute. It's just gonna be a little cross. Guys, it's going good. I just made my first little bunny. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Stop. Oh my god, I'm doing Taylor's little like squeaky laugh. Oh my god, sometimes it comes out in me too. Um, that made me so excited, I had to show you guys. <laughs> Serotonin again. I made a little chick. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, so I've decided I'm just gonna do like two apples tonight, and I'm cutting them kind of thin. Cannot lie. So I don't know if I'm gonna be able to put popsicle sticks through them. They might just have to be like a little pickup kind of deal, um, which is fine. Um, but yeah, oh my God, I'm so excited. All right, here's what we got for tonight. Now, keep in mind, I'm still doing like a little trial run and I didn't want to make too many, um, but now I'm gonna heat up some Ghirardelli melting wafers and then we're gonna dip them. I also have white chocolate. We'll see what I decide to use. I really tried to go off with that one. I'm onto something. I'm still, like I said, practicing. But look at this. These two are my favorite. The bunnies are my favorite. And then I just did a little chick with like the uh, the crunchy sprinkles. And then that is a chick. However, I laid it right in a glob of chocolate, so you cannot tell. But and then two more eggs. Next thing that I'm gonna make, I'm gonna clean up my mess first. Something I learned from my mom. You clean up as you go. Um, and I also learned this from her. Put a little trash bag in the sink so you can just throw your trash as you're going. It makes cleanup easier. Um, I'm not gonna waste this chocolate. I'm actually gonna put it, I'm gonna put some saran wrap over it and put it in the fridge and just like heat it back up for when I do um, my other round for uh, Easter. I think it I think I've got like the hang of it now. I'm so glad I bought a lot of apples because once you cut them down like because of the shapes, you have a lot of leftover apple. And trust me, I'm not wasting apple. Like I will One of my favorite snacks is like fruit. I adore just like eating fruit. Um Anyways, I'm cleaning this up. And then we're gonna move on to dessert number two. Okay, so I'm freehanding this one. Don't remember the exact recipe I saw. What you're gonna need, you're gonna need some yogurt. Light and fit is what I chose, one of my favorite yogurts. Um, and then you're gonna need some strawberries. I'm already cutting the tops off of them. And then you're gonna need some pretzels. Now, I saw these like clusters, I saw somebody now, it was actually one of my favorite TikTokers. Her name is Maddie Kearns, and she goes on all these little hunts for like docks and things. And I am, I just, I check in on her every single day. Um, anyways, I saw her make this. However, when she made this, she dipped it in chocolate. I'm not going to be dipping mine in chocolate. Um, I'm not over these bowls. I'm like, look at my cute bowls. They're, I'm sorry, like they're adorable. Um, so she made like these clusters and they were with strawberries, pretzels, and yogurt. And they were like little frozen strawberry pretzel um, clusters. And then she dipped them in chocolate. Well, I'm gonna just do it without the chocolate um, and see if it like holds up. I think it should hold up. Um, Oh yes. So I'm gonna cut up these strawberries and then um, 
mix it with some yogurt and then crush up some pretzels, mix them all together and throw them in the freezer. Let's do this. I made some strawberry chunk yogurt so far, and now we're gonna crush up the pretzels. All right, I'm not sure how appealing these look, but I did taste the batter, if you will, and damn, it was good. So I'm gonna put them in the freezer now. Kitchen is cleaned up. That is a wrap for tonight. Hi, hello, it is Easter sleepover day, and I am so excited, so, you guys, <laughs> I have pulled one of my delectable treats out and I'm letting it melt. But we're gonna try, oh, this is gonna be a mess to eat, huh? Wait. I think I did something here. I, to be fair, had this sitting out for too long. Like, oh my God, this is so good. Okay, I'm gonna pat myself on the back. That's a sleigh, uh-huh. So I went to Pop Shelf a couple weeks ago and then I went back to get this because I could not stop thinking about this. Look how cute, it's this little ceramic dish. I've decided I'm gonna put little Easter treats. These are my favorite. As you can tell, I've already eaten some. They didn't last. But I'm gonna put some, ah! Okay. I'm gonna put some in each slot be cute. This is going to be really cute. Slot number two. What's an Easter little sleepover without jelly beans? That sounds like a crime. I've been pondering I'm like, what movie should we watch tonight? Um, I'm not very sure. However, I can tell you. Oh my God, this is so cute. This is looking cute. You guys, look. Look how cute that's looking. I just need to finish this one. But I've been thinking, I'm like, what movie should we watch tonight? So I've got some suggestions. One is High School Musical. One is the Hannah Montana movie. You're probably thinking, Rachel, your mom does not want to watch that. Hey, to tell you something. She told me a couple weeks ago she wanted to watch the Hannah Montana movie. So that might be, okay. These are the creamsicle jelly beans. That's why you do stuff over the sink. Well, those were the creamsicle jelly beans. <laughs> nice! <laughs> In the words of Taylor Swift. I'm gonna be honest with you. These kind of taste like a cleaning supply. Not that I know what a cleaning supply tastes like, but it's not giving me creamsicle. Ooh, what is that? Mm, well. This is really cute. This is really cute. Mm. Now, let me take a little intermission. I gotta clean out my sink. You guys, oh my god, they're so cute. Oh, they're they're really cute. Okay, I kind of slayed that one. You know, but you know, oh my god, like that. 
than that. And the bunny, stop, stop. That's really cute. Guys, these are the cutest napkins I think I have ever owned. Oh my God. Um, but anyways, I've got this on the table. And then the little Easter baskets out. This is my mom's. I have these Easter cookies from Aldi that I got. And I put my Easter bag that my mom, she was like, you know what? It was a rainy day, so she like packed everything in there. And also so I wouldn't peek. The thing about me is I love a surprise. I'm not going to look. Like even if it was right in front of my face, I wouldn't have looked. Anyways, so she brought it a week ago, but I haven't opened it yet, obviously. I set our little craft out in case we want to do it. Help. Oh. Hi. <laughs> so you want to hear something funny? Are you talking to me? Yeah. Oh, sure. Yes, I love comedy. The last time I was opening an Easter basket, chaos broke. What does that mean? So, <laughs> the last time I was opening my Easter basket, mm -hmm. Um, Emma frantically called me and said, did you, did you see? I was like, no, I'm e opening my Easter basket. She's like, Taylor and Joe broke up. <laughs> that was last Easter. Do you remember yes, that? I yes. do, and I remember April it put 8th. a damper on things. And we <laughs> April 8th, bro. No. I'll why? never forget that. Oh, that's, wow. Memory. Oh, look, this came. <sighs> Help! Help! No, I want it to look pretty. It does look pretty. <laughs> look at that. I got an even prettier one though. No. Yeah. Oh my gosh, you got me cute stuff. No, wait, wait, there's a theme. I see that theme. Beeman cut. That's so cute. I like its face. I think that is the cutest. It's really cute. Isn't it cute? I know you love the big book. Whoops. Help. He I got Advil. Oh, she got me travel size stuff. Yeah, I thought maybe you might need it. I know you like to be here, there, and yonder, so I thought well, across the pond, if you will. Yes, yes. That looks so, like. A, oh, that's an ice cream cone. Yeah, that was just that's a all silly a little sponge. something, but that's so cute. I thought it was adorable. But just a couple. <laughs> I know. I told you there's a theme. Ooh, that's but, um, good. Yeah. Oh my god, that smells really good. Yeah. Ooh, I like it the theme. It smelled us. It's English rose. Yeah, isn't that weird? Um, <clears throat> did you see this? <laughs> Why is my head shaking, bro? I don't know. Oh, that's really cute. Earplugs, I need that. Yeah. Well, that's really cute. Yes. Oh, I'll be using that all the time in the summer. I thought it was perfect. That's so cute. Yeah. Thank but you. But just in case you pick up and go somewhere this summer, <laughs> I just figured <laughs> it would be great to have. <laughs> this is called Hair. Taste testing with Rachel and Mom. We're, yes, we are wearing matching pajamas. Aren't we cute? This is Coca-Cola spiced. <laughs> Why are you breathing like that, bruh? <laughs> Imagine it erupted. <laughs> oh, that would be a really fun. That sounds like you. In the car. I I'm sorry. <laughs> Why does it smell like cleaning solution? Because it probably is. <laughs> no, it doesn't smell like. You know what it smells like? Remember that scented doll I used to have as a kid that was like that strawberry? That was for an arcade. You? Yes! <laughs> it smells like her hair. Yeah, bro. strawberry shortcake. Okay, one, two, three. It tastes like cleaning solution. Oh. Full on Mr. Fucking Bubbles. I mean, oh my god. I love that. <laughs> it tastes like um carbonated spick and span. <laughs> it's not giving. It's giving where's the bucket I'm giving for. <laughs> I mean, what is that? Um, it's you, supposed to be raspberry. Raspberry? Yeah, I, doesn't Fuck. it say that on there? Oh yeah, Coca raspberry Co spice. <laughs> With Coke and other natural flavors. Natural, Mr. Clean. <laughs> yeah, we ran up to the, ew. My mom hid eggs for me. 
I know, aren't I cute? And fun. I'm mostly fun, not the, cute. The you big can, golden egg had Easter socks. And then other ones had candy in them. And now we're gonna taste test some delightful treats Rachel made. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy! These are chicken. God, I hope this is better than that raspberry drink. <laughs> uh, look at these. Look, I think I'll take the small one. They don't. I mean, they don't look very good, to be honest. Well, uh, they look delicious. I had to let mine thaw out earlier. You might. Yeah, I don't want to break my teeth. Let's try one of these. No, those are beautiful. Oh, look how cute. Yeah, let's take a thumbnail. Are you ready? What are we gonna do? <laughs> Take a thumbnail? <laughs> like, <laughs> oh! <Like. laughs> <laughs> Somebody. Excuse me, is that a fucking apple? <laughs> what is that? It's an apple. That? Yes, <laughs> it's the heel of it. That was That's my first. Bread. That was. There ain't no heel of an apple. <laughs> that was the first one that I made. It was a little thick. I thought it was something you got out of the litter box for a second. I'm just, <laughs> I was jacking it. Now, the ones that look delicious to me are that one, <laughs> that one, and that one. Well, they all look pretty what delicious. That? What do you think that's supposed like to be? A mound of shit. <laughs> oh, no! Something the Easter Bunny dropped. <laughs> well, <laughs> yeah. that one's the prettiest. I, I do agree. Okay, uh, which one would you like? I'm gonna try this one. Okay. Yeah. Now, these are apples. <laughs> no, it's really very cute. Taste palette after the Coke. It tastes like. I'm just looking at this. <laughs> <laughs> that I looks like something the cat yapped out. <laughs> but might not for real. Look, it really runs. This is gonna be delicious. I had one earlier, it was very good. What is that? <laughs> <laughs> Yogurt, pretzels, and strawberries. That would be good. Look, we know why Chick fil A is our best friend. No, I'm saying. We were really good. She made some great jelly beans, so. <laughs> I'm kidding. I dropped half the um, cream ones down the sink. Cream ones? Mm -hmm. Don't worry, they're not in there. They're in the sink. God, doesn't hold dear God. Do no. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Did what? You did. I think you tried a chocolate one. I will. <laughs> Once I manage to get this one down. <laughs> That's a pretty hard. That's not a heart. It's a chip. Nothing got scrambled in the egg. 
Oh, uh, look. Okay. Yeah, oh, eat, boy. Eat the... I want you guys to look at the artistry here. It's really cute. Can do that so they can see? <laughs> oh, let me get the rag out of my hand first. Observe. This is mom eating the bunny's head off. Nope. <laughs> no, I'm getting. Uh, I'm giving this another try. You almost said. I can't tell it's an apple because of the chocolate, I think. I don't know, something. I like it. It's a weird taste. Yeah, it's real good. Mm. It's, uh, leave comments below if you'd like some of these shipped to you. No, because you don't. No. Mm. <laughs> Oh, it's been a lot of hard work. It's so delicious. It took me a while on it. Be... This took you how long? Probably 45 minutes. Oh, okay. <coughs> Did you use a cookie cutter? Yeah. <laughs> See? This is the chip. <laughs> here. Well. I kind of see the likeness. Mm -hmm. yeah, Remember when I tried to make those seagull cookies for 1989? Uh huh. <laughs> yeah. They were they were so beautiful and a work of art too. Uh -huh. No, they weren't. I wish these would hurry up. They're gonna be. We'll, we'll be able to try them in a minute. <laughs> mm -hmm. Would you, okay, what would you rate that? Scale? Oh. Um, one out of ten. <laughs> ten being the best. One being the worst thing you've ever put in your mouth. Mm, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> Not even close to that. Um. <laughs> well, I'm going to say... Eight. Eight. I ate two. So I should get some kind of prize, shouldn't I? No, they're really good. <laughs> okay, I cannot wait to try this. Did y'all see them close up? Oh yeah. Did we show the nice people these close up? I don't know about close up. Oh no. Show them. Oh. I, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Do I look like I'm a pro at this? I am not. But look, let me, let me tell you if I was, I'd make some funny videos. I wish you were. First of all, I have a dentist appointment next week. I really don't want to break my teeth. Flavor though. Like vanilla? Fiber and vanilla? Maybe it's the fiber I'm tasting. No, it's um it's very unique. <laughs> Don't give up your day job. <coughs> no, they're kind of good in some strange way. Some or strange in a good way. They're they're different. Where'd you get this recipe? On um, TikTok. Oh, sorry, TikTok. Oh, I mean no. Some people make them and then dip them in chocolate. <laughs> so I feel like I'm eating one of the icebergs off of the Titanic <laughs> with a few strawberries that fell out of the kitchen and some stuff that got trampled on on the way to. Ah, uh, they're different. 
Um, now, if you saw this in a bakery, would you be, would you buy this? <laughs> Just uh, uh, no, no, I don't think so. Uh, I don't think they have frozen things in a bakery. That's why. Well, I think this might be better if it's unfrozen a little bit. Let's put it in the microwave then and see what happens. They're refreshing. I don't want to break my teeth. That's what I was afraid of too. I'm not going to eat mine yet. Well, I'm telling you. This girl can really whip up some <laughs> culinary <laughs> treasures.